talk about gun rights in the wake of the Las Vegas tragedy. What limits should there be on our rights to defend ourselves? Should we be allowed, for example, to keep explosives and chemical weapons or grenades? All right, everyone just settle down a little bit. Uh, the first question is the key question. What should be the limit to our ability to defend ourselves? And there should be no limit to uh, defense. We should not be limited in how we defend ourselves because, I mean, we're not talking about should you have a nuclear weapon in your backyard? Can we just stop those? ridiculous conversations. I think uh, DC versus Heller, right? I think that kind of uh, answers some of those uh, those questions. <laughs>it's about the basics. Why can't I protect myself? Are, are people actually opposed to this idea? Now, I, I can't imagine that they are, but if they are, I would ask them why not. Do I really need the Second Amendment to prove I can defend myself? Well, no. I can defend myself and the ones that I love because I exist. I'm here. And nature, nature's law, I am allowed to protect my right to life. Uh, the Second Amendment is about making sure I can protect myself from that tyrannical government and, oh, by the way, I can use that firearm for a whole bunch of other self-defense motives. Remember, if I can't use a firearm, I'm gonna use my fist if I have a knife.